stock is undervalued by 10% where the book value of stock is 18,000. That means in the balance sheet, stock appears at 18,000, which is the undervalued amount. That means the real value of stock is more than 18,000. Now, this 10% is to be applied on that increased value, which is not given to us in the question. So, if we have to apply this rate to the current book value, we will have to make certain changes. So, actual value of stock, if we want to calculate, that will be equal to 18,000. We can't apply the direct percentage here. So, we want to calculate the capitalized value of the increased stock. So, that will be equal to 18,000 into 100 upon 100 minus R, 100 minus rate, that is 100 by 90, which gives us 20,000. That means that the increased value of stock should be 20,000. So, what is the value of increase? Obviously, since in the book value, the amount was given as 18,000 and the increased value is 20. So, that means the increase in the value of stock is 2,000. There is another way of calculating it. Uh, which I find a little easier, uh, uh, like the students find a little easier to understand actually. So, we can calculate the increase in the value. How can we calculate? Now, since this 10% cannot be calculated on 18,000, therefore, we need to change our rate. So, 18,000 into rate upon 100 minus rate. So, we are going to calculate the increase, but this 10% is to be calculated on the increased value that is 20,000, which is not given in the question. So, if we want to calculate the increase in the value using 18,000, we will have to change our rate. So, rate upon 100 minus rate. Why have we written minus here? Because in, in this 18,000, the increase is not included. Therefore, rate upon 100 minus rate, which gives us 2,000. So, the increase in the value of stock is 2000. Now, since this is an increase in the value of a stock, stock is an asset, asset increases means asset have a DR balance. Therefore, our entry will be stock account DR to revaluation account.